and welcome back to Final Fantasy 7 where I've got to level with you. Mistakes have been made. Yes, indeed they have. Let's go and get going here. Uh, hopefully, editing me is going to put a bit of a flashback in now. Let's let's go for that. You know what? I don't I don't care about Alex uh, about the javelin. Would you believe that the javelin was actually Sid's like uber growth weapon that has two link slots on it and and like is just kind of the best weapon you could ever get for growing materia and leveling up? Yeah, yeah. It turns out I have made a big big error. So we're gonna come over to Icicle and see what we can do about that. I I have a rather nasty suspicion though, if I'm to be honest with you. Uh, obviously the barrier came down across the caves and they probably don't want us going back there I told you you can't you didn't tell me what, what do you mean there's a steep hill past here you shouldn't go any further that's that's annoying what, what do you say there's a barrier at the north edge of the crater you shouldn't go any further well shouldn't and can't are two very different words okay well thankfully we have a wonderful flying machine that should enable us to go and have a, a look see so let's go and have a look and see what we can do Wait, maybe we can get it I was uh, kind of hoping there's a few items that you can get from bone village from digging oh we're gonna have a fight we're gonna have a fight and a lot of those are items that are kind of locked if you don't get them at the right time unfortunately i do not believe the javelin is one of them so maybe we'll go do some digging in bone village today just to go find out counter attack and a proper hit that's good i'm amazed that barrett's the one that always hits first mm, good old cup of tea there uh tiffa leveled up nice nice might get rid of well no we, we said we were going to go for level 44 before we got rid of these guys right i, I remember that being a thing but yeah let's let's go to bone village quickly no we're not going to bone village we're gonna we're gonna fly over here go down this canyon this was the way that the the snowboard took right I, I believe or at least that's that's the impression we're supposed to be given is this the way the snowboard went this is then the great glacier this must be where the horrible witch woman hangs out uh, that that's what I'm going to extrapolate or maybe maybe even down in there could be could be I didn't really get much feeling of walking across a glacier whilst uh, going across that ice field uh, this is the northern crater oh, what the hell was that that came buzzing past here like a powerhouse that's that's how Sid talks now so we can't we can't put down anywhere here unfortunately that's uh, that's major major uh, upsetting but whilst we're here there is a thing there is a secret. There's a secret up here. Where is it? There you are. Hey, buddy. What's going on? Let's let's put down here and go say hello to this random house here. Are you about? Hey, look at this. What's this? Fuck! Oh, he gave me a thing. Enemy skill. Yeah! I've already got two of those. Okay. Well, who are you? What's going on? Ho, ho, ho! It's unusual for people to come to such an out-of-the-way place. Is it Purple Santa? He looks like he might be Purple Santa, that, that thing. I can't remember how long it's been since my last guest. Aren't you supposed to fly around and give people presents? Uh, who, who are you? Me? I'm... Uh, I, I don't know. What? You, you don't? You don't know who you are? It's been a while since I gave it a thought, actually. What was it they used to call me? Ah, yes, they used to call me the Chocobo Sage. That's right, yes. That's... Yes, the Chocobo Sage. Look, I predicted what he was going to say there. <laughs> That's crazy. Who, who would forget that? Like, honestly. Now, what can I do for you? Mm, uh, what about that Chocobo? You, you, that, that green one over there. That Chocobo? Well, that one is special. Let's see now. I don't quite remember. Well, you're you're helpful. Well, we had a little chat to him. What, what else can we do? Uh, in, interact with anything? I don't see anything. I like the artwork on the wall. What can I do for you? Do you remember anything? Let's see now. I don't quite remember. Okay. Um, what, what, can you, what can you sell me? What can you sell me? Nuts. He sells me nuts and greens. I mean, these are pretty good, but they're not quite what I'm after. Can I sell him anything? Oh, I don't want to sell him anything. Why would I want to sell him anything? I've got a feeling this is going to have bearing on our later game, maybe. Th those of you that know, know. But we'll, we'll go with that. So, let's try and find Bone Village. That's the next thing we want to do. It's just a little bit further around if I carry on turning. There it is. This is the place where we can run into some hideous, hideous things. But I thought we might do some digging whilst we're here. Five minutes digging. It's not, not the end of the world. Let's uh, see what's going on. Well, I mean, like, the end of the world is coming. 
but uh, may maybe maybe we should we should do this. Let's let's start some digging. Uh, other than the lunar harp, well, I'm not looking for anything other than the lo lunar harp. We're just looking for good treasure. All right. Uh, sorry, I'm not looking for the lunar harp. We already found the lunar harp. That was the sentence I tried to do there, but I was reading the next box already. Uh, I'll lead you some of my stuff. Show us where you want us to dig. If I remember correctly, it was like square to place stuff. So let's uh, let's try down the bottom here first, shall we? Let's put one there. Order search. Thank you very much. Uh, then we'll have one here, or that search, and then we've got to have one up here. That, that's a good triangle, right? I like triangles. Triangles lead you to, to exact positions, and then press OK, right? Do I need to put a fourth down? Do I, do I like, actually have to? Okay, let's try this one here. Uh, oh no, we got it done there. Okay, cool. Press switch to ignite the bombs for the search. Boom! Alright, watch them all look up that way. Uh, the staff members will calculate the tremors and dig up the buried item. The dig point is where the staff lines meet. They're not going to dig up the buried item. That's... Ooh, ooh, about... Here, I reckon. Move to the dig point and press switch. Bam. Uh, I'm pressing. Press, press. Okay, thanks. Press. Uh, now the staff will dig here. The result will be placed in the box overnight. A whole night spent. I mean, I could have could have done some more surveys, if I'm to be honest with you. Uh, the the thing with this game is it doesn't portray time very well, does it? You, you spend like day. Oh, woot. Oh, woot. You spend days doing stuff, and like the end of the world is coming, and no one really really cares. No one really cares. Good treasure. All right then, I'll lead, lend you some of the staff. Show you where to dig. Okay, let's let's try back upstairs. Let's go. Let's go back up here. Uh, this is where the Lunar Harp was last time, so I'm hoping we can find something else. You and... Oh, have I got to wait for him to sort himself out? Come, come on, buddy. Come on. Thank you. Can we have another one here? Order that search. I might even go for the Extravagant Four up here. It's a, it's a bit wide-ranging, you know. It would be good if we could see. Order the search there. And maybe this one right here? Oh, come on, guys. Just... Can't we have robots or something? They, they can at least fly around, yeah? Uh, once they are up here, we'll go for a done. Wow. Nice, 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 nice. Okay, order, sir. No. What a fool. What a fool. What a fool. Why would I press the button? I mean, it's only 100 gil. It doesn't really matter. But, uh... Oh, we can only put five down. Okay. So we could have done a search across the entire place, really. Uh, let's see where everyone's... Looking, I think they're going for about here. Thanks. Okay, I wonder if we're going to get anything good. I, I, I hope so. I hope it's better than a potion. That, that's for sure. Okay, next morning is down. Put my hand back on the controller and let's have a look. Nothing. 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 500 gil wasted. All right, that's it. I've had enough of this place. I'm going off here. Let's go to Medell and get the next thing done because unfortunately, like, I wanted to do some stuff, right? I wanted to do all sorts of things. Unfortunately, Gold Sorcerer is closed. Bone Village doesn't seem to be giving me the bits I want. I can't get past the cave. I mean, we could go... No, there's not There's not much else we can do. I think there's a, a thing down this way, if I remember correctly. Ooh, I haven't really gone past here recently. Change of colour is interesting. Where is it? Hello? There should be like a series of islands over this way somewhere. Nope. Looks like I'm just going to miss them. I would have thought they would have been fairly visible. Maybe I'm thinking of another Final Fantasy map. Aha. Here's something that we've not found before. This is exactly what I'm looking for. Okay, are we ready for a quick death? You know what? I might even just give it the quick save. Uh, you, you never know. Uh, <laughs> Like stranger, quicker, more unexpected deaths have happened. Once again, I don't have my fury status effect. That's that's a little unfortunate. I would really like to carry that through a little bit further. Hyper. There we go. Let's let's really really uh, stack up those limits. That's that's what I want. So I believe this to be Cactus Island, which is full of cacti. Funnily enough, who, who'd have thought it? Who'd have thought it? I was kind of hoping for. a bit faster turnover if I'm to be honest let's just spin the map sorry to anyone that gets a little bit dizzy off of this there we go just gets the maximum number of steps now are we going to be able to take this guy down quick enough I'm not even going to pull no punches we're going to go Alexander uh, Barrett's going to hit straight in with the hammer blow I'd like I'd like to see if we can take his MP away from him to not 
Uh, blows away one opponent. Oh, okay, maybe not. That, that might not have been what I thought it was. I thought I thought it was one that took MP away because obviously cactuses they do tend to hit you with a thousand needles. I believe the the trick is called. Uh, that was a lot of points. That was pretty good. Just get in there nice and early. Cool, cool, cool. Do we have any healing? We don't. Was that it? Was he was he dead? It's cool. It's cool. What what have we got? Sort of AP wise, this is what I, this is what I really want to know. 100 AP for that fight. I think we can get more elsewhere. I think we can, that's money though. That's money. Let's try and heal Barra up here. Magic? No, 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 no. Magic Tiffa. Magic Cure. Bam. Okay, awesome. Uh, the cactus fight was fun, but I don't think it was profitable enough. Not profitable enough at all. I pressed escape. Not profitable enough at all. There's also another set of islands. Do you, do you guys see them on the map? Uh, they're, they're down past here. I don't think I have literally ever been to them. Ever. So I don't know if they, they hold any secrets. Oh, look, here's the uh, Temple of the Ancients. I don't know if they hold any secrets or what. Or maybe I'm going to get over there and be like, oh, no, I have been here before. But you can see them up there on the top right. Up there on the top right. I've just... I know there is another island up there that you're, we're supposed to not be aware of. Yeah, look at these. Look at these. And they're landable. And they're landable. I wonder... I wonder what goes down here. What... What sort of fight are we going to have? Let's go to the place with the forest here. Let's put down here. Let's let's see what happens. Let's see what happens. What type of creatures are we going to fight today? Be very interested to find out. I wonder where the game thinks we are as well. Because the last one was Cactus Island. I wonder if this has got a, a special name. Come on, battles. Is this on the beach? I think this is on the beach. It's going to be the worm again, isn't it? Oh no, okay, one, one of these things, a uh, jewel horn, okay, let's do, let's leave with a sense, uh, then maybe, maybe a, an earth, level 30, 2500 hit points, nothing really to worry about there, uh, in fact I could probably just do a death blow and finish it off, maybe, I don't know, we'll find out, we'll find out, let's do an attack, come on Sid, do your thing, smash, uh, that wasn't quite an entire death blow, um, but that, that was pretty good. That was pretty good. Nice and quick. Nice and quick. What's the AP from that bad boy? We're leaving. We're off. <laughs> this island, not worth it. Not worth it. Okay, let's go down to Midel and 15 minutes into the episode, let's start a bit of storyline. Why not? That sounds like a great idea to me. Uh, we want to go carry on all the way across. Really disappointing that we can't just like land on these sections. We can go there, but we can't get to that bit over there. Uh, just. You know, I don't. I dislike being restricted. My gamer senses, they're like, no, let me in there, let me in. Is this the right place? That way over there. Okay, cool. I'm gonna put down over here because, you know, a bit of walkie time, it's always a good idea, right? Always a good idea. Maybe we can get a beach fight? Nope. No, all right, we're just gonna walk into town then. Hey, how's it going, buddies? My name's Tiffa, and I am here to talk to you guys. What have we got? We've got some shops. We've got a guy here. Oh, hey, buddy, what's going on? Ahoy! Ain't you, ain't you a beaut? This is Medell. It's a quiet little hot springs town. Just the perfect place for old folk like us to live out our lives. Creepy old guy. I hear that things ain't so peaceful on the outside, but here it's still nice and quiet. Well, I sure hope that continues strong, man. I really do. Let's come inside and have a look. Oh my gosh, what's going on? I love this, this music. Uh, let's let's talk to this guy. Welcome! We always welcome cash. Now, what about... Well, yeah, what do you want? I'm afraid our other customers have already booked it up. There's nothing left. Okay. Just kidding, just a little joke, what can I do? Oh, I, I don't like his jokes, they're very confusing. Let's go to buy and have a look down here. I mean, we've used a few hypers, it might be worth it. Remedies, you say? I will take 10 of those. Bam, that was a lot of money, a lot of money, but they'll be useful at some point, trust me, they really will. Uh, what did I see that we were just running out of? Nothing, nothing to worry about, high potions? I ain't bothered. I am not bothered. Uh, thank you. Come again. All right. Cheers. Maybe, maybe I should actually go. Like, what? What's going on with you? Hi. Uh, so that overgrown moon's gonna fall on us, huh? It's no joke. We've got to start stocking up on supplies before they're all gone. What? Wait. The the rock's gonna hit the planet. What do you think you're gonna possibly do with supplies? Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. No, I, I I don't understand your thinking. Let's let's move on somewhere. Oh, it's much calmer out here. Much, much calmer. Oh, hey there. 
How you doing? My name's Tiffa. Um, gather round, gather round. This is a bargain. We've got the best armor and weapons, the likes of which you won't find anywhere. Oh, really? Best armor and weapons. But it's first come, first serve. So get yours now. Step right up. Don't just stand around outside. Come on, come on. Don't be shy. Step in. I'll never know why he wanted to open a store in a dead town like this. What's with him? I'd, yeah, why would you open a death, dead store? You're, you're here as well. You again! You aren't holding up goods too, are you? Don't reach in front of me. Everything's in this store is mine. I've got money to burn and I've been saving like mad just for a time like this. Come on, out of the way. Move it, William. Oh, man, we've got a prepper. Can I go back there? No, no I can't. Uh, welcome to the charity store. A store of love and courage. What can I get you today? Okay. Um, weapons, I would like. Okay. You're not going to sell me that? I, I suppose I'll live with that. Crystal glove. What we got? Nice, nice uh, trip. Triple quadru... Uh, quip... <laughs> Tongue twister or something. Triple linked slots. I don't know why I could why I travel with that. No idea at all. Long range weapon, crystal microphone, partisan. I don't know who we're going to be bringing out next, so it's worth thinking about it. Oh, look. Yuffy has a better bracelet on. A bangle, or whatever you want to call it. What's the wizard bracelet? That's all of those. That's pretty good. The defense is pretty weak, but like, all those slots. All those slots. All right, let's buy a crystal bracelet for... A crystal bangle, sorry, for completeness sake. Maybe even two. No, 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 because I want to buy a weapon here somewhere. The Winchesters are probably a good idea because I've been going on about how Vincent does not have any decent weapons. Uh, perhaps even... No, Sid's, Sid's currently all stacked out for growth, so let's leave him like that for now. Uh, what else What else we got going in town? There seems to be another shop over here. Looks like we're just going to look around town. Hey, you got something to say? Hey, never seen you around here before. You from out of town? How are things on the outside? Between the earthquakes and the mural, it might just be the end of the world, like everyone's been saying. It. Yeah, it's the end of the world. Like, get yourself on a rocket, get out of here. How depressing, what a miserable world this is. Yeah, end of the world gets, gets like, declared. I'm, I'm just gonna go like do over a sugar and fertilizer factory and build myself a giant rocket to get out because it's gonna be as easy as that, right? Um, you got the like end of the world. You might as well give it a go. Why are you back here? Let's see what you got to say. What, no, have I? I crashed the game. What is this? What? What is this? I can't control. Oh, oh man. Oh, oh. I really thought we were in trouble there. Oh no, not much time left. You're never gonna know when the moon's gonna come crashing down. It's true. It's all gonna come down to it. The world's about money and material and things. If you got them, you can get by whenever, whenever. Gotta buy, gotta buy, buy, buy. I'm gonna stop till I drop. I mean, that's not really very helpful. Welcome. Cash is welcome here. Oh, that's nice. How many? How may I help you? It's amazing how cash is welcome everywhere. You know. Uh, HP plus. Can I? I will. I will. Thanks. Uh, all of these we should already have. But they, they're nice. They're nice. I wonder who needs a bit of an MP boost. Yahoo! Sorry, I was waiting for that that noise. Uh, thank you. Come again. All right. Cool. What? Mm, a little disappointed in the way that that kind of almost crashed out there. I was just seeing if that was something different. I really want to interact with the Chocobo rather than her. I don't know if that's a possibility or what. Uh, okay, let's carry on down and around. Oh! Suddenly, like, I didn't press the button there. It just took took me off on a cutscene. Uh, what's the matter? Are you all alone? You got lost, didn't you? Separated from somebody you love? Silly theater. Projection much? Tiffa, you gotta, you gotta keep your own emotions to yourself, you know? I guess it's been about a week now since he was washed up here on the shore. Poor pokey-headed young thing. Po pokey-headed? He he's got a Pokemon head. It was really sad, but weird. He was holding this really long sword. I don't know, the whole thing, whole thing feels unlucky to me. But the amazing thing was those weird blue eyes. What? Hey? Excuse me. What'd you say? Wait a minute, what did you just say? That's what I just said that. Excuse me, that person you were just talking about. Yeah. A villager found him a little ways down the coast. It was about a week ago, I think. A week, eh? Hey? Is that how long we've been done? Like, it could have been. Days have just passed. Poor kid. He must have drifted from somewhere pretty far away. Cloud. Must have been Cloud. Oh, wait. I was asleep for a week as well, wasn't I? Yeah. Good job, Tiffa. Good job. Yeah. Got it. Yeah, well done, Tiff. We totally didn't just like stumble upon this. So where is he? Is he safe? Where is he now? Up there, up at the clinic. The guy just pointed. Didn't give me directions. Just pointed. He's alive. Cloud's alive. 
Uh, okay, cool. Um, I mean, like, is he actually Cloud? Are we, are we still sold on this or not? I don't know. I don't know. Shake your heads, shake your heads. Cloud! Hey, you barging in here like Meteor was crashing down or something. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Doctors and their dry humor. I'm sorry, but I heard a friend of mine was here. Uh, a friend? Oh, that young thing? Don't worry, he's next door, but his condition it isn't so good. He's in there. Over here. Oh, cloud. Um, ooh. I mean, he can move his wheelchair, that's good. Oh, cloud, I'm so, so glad you're safe. <clears throat> Exclamation marks. Wheeze. What? Cloud. Ah. No, cloud, what's up? What's wrong, Cloud? Agak! Is that, is that how that's right? Cloud! What happened to you? Mako poisoning. Quite an advanced case. It appears this young man's been exposed to high levels of Mako energy for an extended period of time. He probably has no idea who or where he is now. Poor fellow. He can't even speak. He's literally miles away from it. No, he's literally right there. Uh, like, literally is not the word for it, okay? Some place far away where no one's ever been. All alone. I mean, that's where he came from, though, right? Doctor! No? Damn, that's evil. I mean, that's pretty pretty, pretty cold there. That is bad. That is pretty nasty. Cloud! Cloud, why? <clears throat> let's, let's, let's just excuse ourselves, shall we, guys? Listen, would you all mind waiting outside? Uh, but I'm there! I'm gonna check out with my friends! That's what I do! Yeah, Sid's like, hmm... This guy that I met two weeks ago. <laughs> it was about that long ago, right? I mean, we were at Rocket Town. Then we jumped on the tiny Bronco. And we met with uh, Yuffie. And then suddenly with all this like cave business happened. Now clouds, a dribbling mess. Exposed to life essence. Why? What do you want me to do? Please, Cloud, please talk to me. Tell me you see me. Tell me you hear me. Tell me, please. <laughs> I don't know, Tiff. I, th I think he's pretty messed up. Like, he dropped in the live stream. Like, the, the earth opened up and he fell down into the spirit energy. I made it this far believing in the memories we shared. This isn't happening. It's too cruel. It's too cruel. Oh, Cloud. <sighs> Cry noise. This calls for a cup of tea. So, what about him? You know, Cloud. I'll say it again. He's got Mako poisoning. I've never seen a case this bad. An, Im an immense amount of Mako drenching knowledge was infused in his brain. It's a miracle he survived. No normal human could have. Could have. No wonder. After falling in the live stream and being washed up here. But remember, the light of hope can be found anywhere. If you give up hope, what will happen to him? Uh, hope. I remember hope. Biggs. Wedge. Hey, but honestly, man. Do I... Do I really want him to come back? What did he do for the world? What can he do for us from here on out? He may be nothing more than a Sephiroth shadow. It's, uh... Something wrong? No. No, 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 Doc. Tiffers, dots. Yeah. You okay? Yes. I'm sorry to worry you all. There's something I want to say to you, okay? So we go, we got, you couldn't tell us here. We gotta go back inside. We got, oh, I've gotta listen to a wheeze boy over there. I don't care about anything else, only Cloud. Oh, what? Why? He's not even real, man. He's not real. I wanna be by his side. Yeah, right. Hang in, Tiff. Yeah. Uh, it's probably the best, I think, maybe. For, you, for Cloud, and you. Yeah. Keep him out of the way. I'm sorry, everyone. Especially now. Yeah, end of the world. Just, you know, watch over this one guy. Uh, you take care now, Tiff. Take care of Cloud. Alright, cool. Good luck. Like, are you just... Uh, and Tiff, I don't know how asking this, but... Are you sure he's really your friend? Not just Sephiroth's shadow? It's, 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 a, it's a fair question. Uh, well, that is... No, I'm sure of it. Yeah, okay then. Sorry sorry for asking. 
Now we gotta be headed back to the high wind. All right, let's do the high wind. Yeah, high wind, high wind's cool. So we, we just lost Tiff as well now. So who's the leader? What are we gonna do now? What can we do? What do we reckon, guys? There ain't nothing we can do. <laughs> and, and, and don't go telling us wait for Cloud to get better, because he ain't getting no better. Oh, I've got some news. Oh yeah, Cat Sith. Yeah, what? <laughs> that you're a spy? <laughs> Uh, yeah, I've already told you that I was. That, yeah. Dude, seriously. Um, both Gengaka and Kachaka are up to something. Wanna eavesdrop? What? We can we can watch? Can we, can we watch? Is that a thing we can do? Now then, we're faced with two issues. Destroy Meteor, remove the barrier around North Cave and defeat Sephiroth. Any ideas? <laughs> the first problem's already solved. Meteor will soon be smashed to bits. The plan is already in motion. We are collecting huge materia from each region. Wow. Huge materia is high density special type of materia that made it through a special compression process in Mako reactors. Of course, I mean like, more. The energy extracted from it is 330 times the strength of a normal materia, otherwise known as a Coke can's worth. How about that? <laughs> We will gather huge materia together and ram it into Meteor. That will cause a huge explosion, reducing Meteor literally to bits, pepper shotting the planet. Is that what we're saying here? You go to ram Meteor? Do you think we haven't we have the technology to do it? First things first, right now we've got to collect the huge materia from each area. We're already collecting materia from Nibelheim, and all that's left are Corral and Fort Condor. I've already dispatched troops to Corral. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, cool. Corral? That's my hometown. What else are they gonna do with a corral? And the huge materia? You mean the huge materia, don't you? I've heard about that. When our small materia nears the large ones, there should be some reaction. I'm certain of it. That's why we're using the materia's power in our fight. But can't, but can't let Shinra get hold of the huge materia. Besides, when Cloud gets back, I wanna show him this huge materia. He's gonna be so shocked. Ah, uh, because he's a lightning guy, right? No? So what are you saying, Barrett? Even though you're always knocking him, you really want Cloud to return? Ah, I like the guy. <laughs> I ain't saying nothing about nothing. Just shut your face. <laughs> Every group's gotta have a leader. And that's me. <laughs> or at least I wanna be. But I ain't cut out of being no leader. <laughs> I never knew that until lately. Uh, that's where it is. Huh? Huh? What? <clears throat> What's going on? You've been chosen. <laughs> You've been chosen to be the next new leader, guy. Pain in the ass. Forget it. I don't know why they both got the same voice. <laughs> but for us to fight, we gotta have the high wind and you. We need to save the planet. And who's running the this ship? You are. That's why you're our new leader, and ain't no one else can do it. Not sure I'm impressed with this. The ship's gonna save the planet, huh? Ain't that gonna be a little tough? But I'm Sid, so I can do it. Stab me in the heart. I'm the man too. <laughs> okay, I'll do it. Everyone, follow me! Right, now here's the first job. The operation room's waiting for you. Oh yeah. Let's go, Sid, with your funny little run. I love, oh, look at it. Ah! He goes everywhere like that. <laughs> Yo, Sid! <laughs> when you're ready, we're heading for the Corral Reactor. Come on, leader man, let's hurry. Okay, man. Yuffie's like, Sid? I'm the leader now. What do you want to say about it? I know you've been all dying to talk to a babe like me, but just leave me alone. This shit makes me... <laughs> all right, all right, I can do that. All right, well, with that, and Sid's new leadership. Woo! Shit. Uh, I'm gonna say thank you very much for joining me for this adventure. I will see you guys uh, next time. We're gonna go uh, North Corral, maybe. Unless we can actually like get inside the Chocobo races and stuff like that, then we might do a bit of that. But I will see you then. Oh, when we're gonna do that? <laughs>